I don't think you can put Francis in a, in a group. You know, I, I don't think, I mean, there are as many progressive liberals who are upset with him mm -hmm. as there are conservatives, mm -hmm. you know, from different perspectives and for different reasons. And, and so I guess I get uncomfortable when we start talking uh, about him from that from that perspective. I, I think, uh, so that's my, my first thought. The, the other most honest, th I've been thinking about this for the last few days in light of this, and of today, and I, and I gotta tell you that he makes me uncomfortable. Um, and I think it's important to say that. And, and the reason he makes me uncomfortable <clears throat> is not a bad one at all. And that is that I think he calls us to something that I don't think I do very well, and that I'm not sure we do very well. You know, he, he calls us to, to, to care and to love for the marginalized and the poor. And we have all the pretty words, and we can sit here and say, oh, isn't that wonderful that he's, that he's calling us to all of that. And except for Margaret, who, who rubs elbows with, with, with these folks every day, I, I just think, you know, that's all very nice. But I, I, it, it scares me, and it makes me feel uncomfortable, because I'm just, I'm not, I don't respond to that terribly realistically and honestly. Uh, and, I, and so I, I guess I need, I need to be challenged and I need to be asked the question, how do, what do I do about that? You know, what, 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 what's he calling me to? Uh, and I think, I, I think that in some ways, maybe the most important, uh, the most important gift that I think he's bringing uh, to me, certainly, and to, and to our church and our world.